All right, welcome to your new Cougar x Lite 25 RDB from Keystone. Um, this has been an awesome rig for us. We're sad to see it go, but we hope that a new family will enjoy it as much as we have. We've added a ton of extras onto this, and so I'm just gonna point out some of those features. Um, starting at the front here, we have the anti-sway bars. We have an electric jack, two propane tanks, and two batteries. Um, on this side here, you have your one slide out, and then you have a full pass-through storage off to the other side. All of this is coming with the rig. This includes all of your sewage dumping supplies, your stabilizers, the x chocks the cones, the chocks, the leveling blocks, an extra battery. Um, and then this is just a little toolbox filled with miscellaneous supplies and your surge protector here. Back around to the other side, and this is also going to have your winter RV tarp for covering it in the winter time if it is outdoors. So this has been covered every winter. Um, moving to the back here, again this does have the polar package, and it does have the access if you wanted to set up your cable outside or your TV outside, you have the cable hookup right here. Your outdoor kitchen, which has a two burner stove and then tons of extra grilling supplies with your s'mores sticks and the grill racks and extra little tablecloth back there and then a little mini fridge for beverages. On the back, you have um, a hitch mount that can support a bike rack or a storage tray and then your pass-through storage we're also including in there um, a little Black & Decker hand vacuum and then a collapsible laundry basket it can be accessed from the interior on that side. Um, your extra spare tire is right here. And then if you are interested, we do have this Honda generator. It's a 2200. It has uh, about 10 hours on it, so it has a lot of life left. If you are interested in purchasing, we would consider selling this at an additional price. Okay, let's go back inside. All right, a little step up here. I'll just point out as well, you have your retractable awning up here, and then there's lots of outdoor lights and speakers. Okay, so inside we go. We're selling this fully stocked with all of your linens. Um, these are all brand new with a, mattress, a memory foam mattress topper as well. The highlight of this RV and this rig is really that this is a king size mattress that's kind of unheard of in an RV. Um, so it's a great size space. You have wonderful closet space here. You have overhead closets and tons of storage underneath here. I'm not giving you a great view there, but tons of under bed storage. And then you'll see I've added this shoe rack or little organizer as well. So really great. You do have a vent in here as well for some air circulation. This is kind of your master control panel, a little extra shelf here and tons of hooks throughout we've added. So um, I'll also point out that we got rid of the ugly brown and gave this a fresh new coat of paint. So this is all nice and light and bright. We've taken down the valances that really kind of covered up most of the windows and instead giving you these easy pull or easy up um, shades, which just kind of pop right up and can come down super easy. Okay. So into your kitchen, the highlight of this kitchen truly is the amount of counter space for the size of this RV. Um, this counter space is so fantastic. You have plenty of space to prep and tons and tons of storage space. I'm going to point out all those options to you, but we've also included some really easy hacks for how to travel and make the most of your space. So utensils and everything, I just usually pop those right down here into this huge drawer for while we're on the road. We're selling this again with all of the pots and pans. And then another huge drawer. These are stackables. Um, the pots and pans are great. Um, up here, you can access from the other side as well, but this is all of your dishware. You have three drawers down here. Pull them out really quickly for you to see. Tons of storage. And then again, underneath the sink, plenty of storage for paper towels, um, paper goods, cleaning supplies, and so forth. 
you do have an oven, stove, and then I love these hooks for when you're traveling. Pop your silverware back there. When you're at the campsite, just pull out your bucket and set it on the picnic table outside. Um, these all hook on and these are great for while you're traveling. Uh, a little espresso maker and your milk frother. I've included a frother for you in case you like lattes. And then this little bucket I usually would just use for olive oil and salt and pepper. Okay, you also have your microwave and then a magnetic spice rack. Great size uh, refrigerator. And then I'm gonna show you actually right here, the uh, pantry. So the pantry has motion sensor lights and then some organizing racks two more drawers below for great space. The dinette comfortably seats about six people and um, can turn into a bed if you'd like. There is under storage all the way underneath and all around. So that is also available for storage. Your entertainment center has the Bluetooth speakers and again, storage above and below. We actually have never filled up all the storage, even on a five week road trip. We still had plenty of space. Um, in the back, again, this is your kind of your pass through storage underneath that you can access from the exterior. Two full size bunks, again, both with mattress toppers that are memory foam mattress toppers, and they each have their own little fan. Back here, we have the bathroom. It's a good sized bathroom. My husband is 6'5". He can stand up and shower in there so it accommodates a tall person and the way that the toilet is situated you're not hitting your knees against a wall which is nice. Plenty of storage space again underneath. Um, this little doodad I use for um, a blow dryer, a curling iron, any of those items. And then lastly you have a little medicine cabinet up here. Okay. Uh, and this is also, I forgot to show you, is the closet for the bunks back here. Plenty of space again, another two drawers. I can't tell you how much storage space this rig actually has. It's been phenomenal. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you'll make it yours.